Hi, my wonderful Sagittariuses. I hope all is well. This is your next 72 hour psychic predictions. If you're new to my channel, welcome, welcome. I'm happy you stopped by. All right, Sag. So before we get started, we're going to give a thank you to our sponsor today, which is Keen. Thank you, Keen, for sponsoring today's video. I want to go ahead and say, Sag, that if at the end of this reading you feel like you need your own personal reading, because what I'm saying is really hitting home and you're like, that's my situation. I need to go deeper. Go ahead and click on my discount code. You can find it in the description box, okay? If you click that discount code, you can get your first 10 minutes for $1.99, all right? Keen has several psychics, several tarot card readers. Um, they have astrologists. Whatever you're looking for, you name it, they have it. What's wonderful about Keen is that they have an advisor that's available morning, noon, or night. So you don't have to wait like a couple of days to get a personal reading. Like you can go ahead and get one very quick, which I absolutely love that. And also what's wonderful about Keen is they channel very fast. So say you go ahead and click that discount code and you want to get an, a question answered, they will be quick to respond within that 10 minutes to get your um, answer. So I love that. So go ahead, go ahead and try it out. I highly recommend Keen. All right. Don't sit around being stressed out worried about something, get yourself the clarity you deserve, all right? And get yourself one of these wonderful Keen advisors. All right, thank you Keen for sponsoring my video. With that being said, let's go ahead and get into your reading, Sag. It is getting hot in here. Good God. Some of you might be overheating, um, something getting hot because while I'm trying to do your reading, I started getting really hot. I don't know if someone's getting hot flashes. Maybe you're experiencing hot flashes or in a really hot place, Sag, but that's what I'm getting. <coughs> All right. For my wonderful Sages, what is going on with my wonderful Sages in the next 72 hours? What's the highlight situation? What's going on with them in the next 72 hours? We have the Nine of Wands here. Someone here might be getting, getting a trophy. I don't know why I'm getting this. Um, some of you might be getting a trophy or something like that. Or something about a trophy in the next 72 hours. Um, what is Sagittarius's obstacle? The Sag's obstacle. We have the emperor here. Okay. And what is, I say cancer, what is Sagittarius's uh, blessing? Love that. And what is Sagittarius's advice? My Sag's advice. All right. Thank you. Okay, my wonderful Sagittarius. So, as I look at your cards, what I'm seeing right here with the Nine of Wands and the Six of Chalices, which is the Six of Cups. Okay. For one, I feel like for some of you Sagittarius is what I'm picking up on. Excuse me, I feel like I need to burp. <laughs> Sorry about that. What I'm picking up on is there's something about you giving, putting out money for your children. Um, there's something that you're having to pay for for your children I'm getting. Something to do with that. Um, for others of you, I feel like there's someone for, from the past that wants to give you some money to um, pay off something. I feel like there's someone from the past that wants to give you some money to help pay for something. I'm getting something about feeling broke as a joke or something like that. <clears throat> I feel like something from the past or even it could be something that you did from the past that's allowing you to have some money to pay some to prevent something I'm getting. Um, I'm also seeing that you that Sagittarius, you are really focused in the next 72 on how to continue establishing your independence. I feel like that is heavily on your mind, like staying independent here. Um, I do see what the obstacle is with the emperor and the nine of pentacles. I feel like you're trying to get resources or expand your knowledge on how to 
go about something independently. It's, that's what I'm getting, like going about something independently. Um, you're having to, you're trying to get some type of knowledge there. I'm also getting something to do with a cat because they're telling me something about the cats. There's something to do with cats as well. Um, I'm getting Cats the Musical for someone here. Others of you, there's probably a, a cat video or you have a cat um, and your cat is doing like chasing something that something, it's like your, your cat is doing something that it doesn't normally do. Like something is highlighted in the next, in the next 72 um, when it comes to your cat. Um, for some of you, they might literally be chasing like a mouse or something like that and maybe Maybe they do do that all the time. I don't know, but I'm getting something to do with cats, cat video, something to do with cats in the next 72. <coughs> um, and I'm also picking up on this message. This is funny. Um, something about a new cat. I don't know what this is. Something about a new cat for someone as well, a new cat. All right. Thank you, Spirit. Um, what I'm getting right here also for your blessing spirit is coming through and saying let me elevate you so you guys are being elevated we have the six of swords with the stars in reverse so i feel like with what this is basically saying is there could be like something that you hoped for that didn't happen oh they're saying a blessing in the skies oh that's what they're saying with these cards they're saying that there's something that you may have been disappointed with, like it didn't go your way. You were hoping for something and you're having to move on. They're saying that that's a blessing, like they're working behind the scenes. There's a blessing in disguise. Um, they're saying to keep your head up. If there's something that you hoped for and it didn't work out the way you thought, it was a major blessing. That's what I'm getting. They're saying that you're going to be moving towards, you're moving towards calmer waters and they're also showing me the illusion card. Um, even though it may not seem like you are, they're saying that you actually are moving towards calmer waters. All right. Last but not least, what Spirit is saying with the Four of Cups here is don't fall into depression. Don't fall into depression. All right. You have a new cup. <laughs> you have a cup that's in front of you. Take the cup. Be content with your life. Your life is beautiful. Don't fall into this woe is me stuff. <clears throat> All right. What else is happening for my Sages in the next 72? What else is happening? We have child right here. So children are very significant. Something may be going on with your children. Um, or a child, a male in particular for some of you Sages. Um, but I do see playtime, like you you spending time in playing, something about playing, okay? Playing more. I'm also getting sadges that there's something that you're actually enjoying learning about as well. And if that's not what um, it is for you, Spirit is telling you to regain that like thirst for knowledge. <coughs> it says at this time, the situation or outcome is unlikely to occur. So there's something that is unlikely. I kind of want to pull what that is. Woo! Give me just a second. Like all my cards just went woo everywhere. Okay, give me just a second. Yeah, I feel like this is a link to the blessing in disguise. There's some type of blessing in the six, six, disguise with the star in reverse and the six of six of swords. They're saying that it's unlikely to occur right now, and there's some type of blocked change, but it's for a reason. Like you might be paralyzed, feeling paralyzed with something, and you're trying to gain some knowledge on how you go about it independently, how you regain your independence. Some of you, it could be something to do with your independence because I'm really getting in, independence and some type of step back. But they're saying it's not supposed to happen right now and it's for a reason. It's for your protection. All right. Okay. 
They're saying to guard your heart also. It was it was a happening to help guard your heart. All right, for my Sagittarius. What's going on with my Sagittarius is in the next 72? Um, they're saying wisdom and light. You guys are having like some wisdom coming in. Okay. It says, stop letting your emotions rule you. It says time to change things up. They want you to change things up. Also, embrace your wild side for once. Embrace your wild side. And we do have someone wants your hand in marriage. Some of you may actually be getting married or engaged, or it could be someone who wants to be your business partner, all right, to collab, to work together. All right, Sagittarius, if you like this reading, hit the thumbs up, hit subscribe if you really like it, and I'll talk to you guys later.